going on, guys? This is June Archer, the Winter Circle here on this 50.com. I hey. have the amazing Patina Miller who joins a plethora of women who will stand beside this amazing gentleman who is the total package and still has the juice. Please welcome Patina Miller and Omar Epps. What's going on, guys? How does it feel, hey, Omar, for you? Brother, you are so blessed to just find a way. The universe just has a way of giving you a bunch of franchises. How does it feel to now join the Power franchise? It feels amazing. It feels amazing. Um, I was a fan of Power, you know, prior to this. And uh, when this when this opportunity came to me, you know, um, I thought that the show itself, the story, you know, exploring uh, the origin story of Canaan was super interesting. And, you know, selfishly for, you know, Detective Howard, his part in that um, was just really fun and, and just like really something that I, I as, a, as a creative, wanted to explore and the opportunity to work with the incredible Patina Miller. You know, you can't pass that up. You know what I mean? There's, there's just certain things you just got to do and say <laughs> yes to. So now, Patina, let me it. ask you this guy has some iconic movie roles with some amazing women, and you are now the latest to join that long line of women, and you are doing an amazing playing Raquel Thomas, the mother of Kane and Stark. How does it feel to play this role next to this young man right here? I mean, I, I feel really amazing. Uh, I love Omar Epps. <laughs> I'm such a fan of his, but you know, this character right here, she's amazing. Um, I did not go into it, uh, nervous, if you will. I was more than anything excited to be able to bring her story to life and bring this character to life. She is so real. She's so raw. She's very relatable. There's going to be a lot of women out there um, who will be able to relate to Rock and why she is the way she is, and they're going to understand her. And so, you know, we've had, we've had a uh, ghost you know, we've had Tariq in book two, and now you get to have Raquel Thomas uh, get to figure out what her her whole power of it all is. And, you know, she's a boss and it's uh, mm -hmm. it's time and I'm excited. So, yeah. Now, this is set in the 90s, South Side, Jamaica, Queens. Music is a soundtrack to our lives. So I got to ask you all what 90s song or 90s hip hop or R&B artist or group best represents your journey up to this point for you, Patina? Oh my God, my journey as the, the character or? Just or individually, the, individually, you. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and say Queen Latifah. I think <laughs> she is everything. I think she was so authentic. She's always been very authentic in who she is. And she was, you know, her music at that time, you know, she was very much out there and very much about being myself and being bold. And, you know, that's basically, who I'm vibing with, who I'm going to say, and that is probably going to be like Rock's girl as well, so. <laughs> All right, Omar, for you, because you, you, we're not even going to talk about the Juice soundtrack. You got a lot to choose from, but for you, yeah. what song best represents your journey up to this point or recording artist? I can't pick one song. I, I just got to go with a line. Yeah. It's Jay-Z, Biggie, and Nas. Like, you know, <laughs> that, was a, that was a magical time um, um, for us and, and um, you know, it's it's uh it's incredible, at least with Jay and Nas, you know, see where they are today is so inspirational. It, it just shows the trajectory of life, how it can go. And that's what it's about. It's about getting older, it's about getting wiser, it's about evolving, you know. Um, so I hope the younger generations take that note. Well, I appreciate y'all bringing these characters to life. Patina, Raquel Thomas, AKA Rock, Detective Howard, played by Omar Epps, Sundays on Stars, the third installment of Power. Raising Canaan, y'all can't miss it. It's here. Listen, Omar, I had to say it, brother. You got the juice now. This is Jumar.com, <laughs> <laughs> the Winter Circle. Thank y'all for tuning in. We love y'all. God bless y'all. We're going to be following you, this journey. Listen, each and every Sunday, we're going to be there. Hey, Rock, we love you. Hey, thank, thank you. you.